Our next video is really about advanced usage of segment. Uh, so we, you know, in the example, we are showing you very basic, hey, here's a JavaScript, here's one source, here's one destination. I want to show you a little bit what happens when you have multiple sources, when you have multiple things flowing to each other, right? And then we start to have uh, very interesting ways of, of seeing the data flow through. So here's a, a product. It's actually about halfway done in terms of implementation. So, you know, they set up a JavaScript source on the website and that's being sent to 20 different destinations, right? So they have email tools, they have pixels, um, they have send desk, right? Um, they have a lot of different things here that, that's receiving this data, right? Now the same thing on the mobile side, this will eventually also send data to all those different tools, right? iOS and Android. Um, and then of course they had uh, a few other things uh, that they'll be adding here, something like Facebook lead ads, uh, active campaign, and a few of the uh, cloud apps that segment supports. But you start to see uh, where you can really start to save time, you know, manually implementing each here implement uh, connection can take a lot of time. But now we can easily automatically send all those different sources, uh, all this all this data, all this JavaScript, you know, web data into all these different destinations, and then we can start to com combine multiple sources. There, the product is actually cross-platform. Um, so there, are people buy on the web, but actually they use it on the mobile app, so iOS and Android. So eventually they'll be able to track the single user journey from the website to the mobile apps and to anywhere else. We'll likely even have some um, backend libraries here sending data, right? So multiple data sources into different destinations, into different sources, right? So this is this is what, what, what segment can eventually look like for, for really uh, more advanced companies who have a lot of data that has to flow through different ways, right? And they, they need uh, a, a way to maintain it uh, without going crazy without having to write a lot of code. So just to show you, I thought it'd be interesting for you to see uh, some of the more advanced use cases of, of segment.